Hey guys, KingLink86, aka Raymond. Welcome to another reaction video of Dragon Nuggets. Well, guys, sorry that it, it took me a while to get on. It's because I just came home from Comic Con. <coughs> and I also have lunch. I went to the con. I was able to see uh, an actor from uh, from Power Rangers Beast Morphers. He played the Blue, Blue Ranger. His name was Jazz. And if you guys uh, follow me on Instagram or Twitter, you'll see the picture uploaded soon. But right now, Let's take a look at this video confronting Big Brother about mo for moving out. Can't wait to see what he has to say. Chicago, I got my nephew's wedding. Yeah. So I need somebody to video everything. Chicago? Yeah. I'll hang it up. Don't even, I know you're Oh, so, oh I, so it's their yeah, wedding? Do that last minute, dude. Why not? Do that. What are you talking about? Oh, like, Chicago. You know, oh, it's a wedding? I'm kind of busy. What do you mean, kind of busy? Yeah, I can't just go to Chicago. I got what, you got to go. sweet or what? Yeah, some. some. Well, when I looked, everything was done basically in the room. Well, I got more stuff to do. Jazz! Here we go. Can't use you. I gotta go for another one. Jazz! You got your suit pressed? We come on. We got the wedding this weekend. What wedding? Wilbur's wedding. Wait, Your cousin? Goes. I don't know who that is. Don't don't, no, no, don't play dumb. Come on. Yeah, I barely know him, Dom. It doesn't matter. We're all flying out. It's all about family. Come right on, What are you even doing anyway? I want all my old tapes. And I'm like thinking back to all the videos. I just, I got this fan mail too. You never gave me this. What do you mean I never gave it? Oh, that's for you. He said something in there for you from Nathan. Trump Pence 2020, so that's funny. That's what he said. He's a loser. He sent me story fire. I don't know what that was anyway. <laughs> I'm not going. He'll be reinstated in, in August anyway. So. I'm not going. Like no, he won't. Psycho Dad. No, he won't. Oh, now you have to say he's my cameraman. All the crap you can do with that. I don't want him in here. If you're in my house, he can video you. Alright, well, you're fair game. Okay. I'm not going to. I'm what is it, like nostalgia? Is that what you're doing? You're like, like looking through your old stuff, trying to figure out where your life went? Where my life went? Yeah. No, I'm just, I don't know. Remembering. Let go of the past. Is it not the same anymore? Life isn't the same anymore. That's why they call it the past. Oh, Snap the hell out of it. I know. You want me to make videos and you want me to be excited and make money, but I'm like, it's not the same, Dad. I just want to be able to enjoy it, and it's not, I'm not. I'll be 60 next year. Life sucks. You know, wow, 60? Okay. You, he's he's so, a year older than my dad. My dad's so, older than him. It's because you're excited, because you're inspired. I've been inspired. No, there's no excitement. There's no inspiration in life. You know what? Everything's around you is family. When you were born, when your brother was born, I want me to pay my debts, and I don't. I'm not. I can't. I'm not a performing monkey. I can't just go in front of the camera and force something. You've done it for how many years? Yeah. You uh, shot your wife. You pre premature ejaculated. You spent all your money. Wow. Get over yourself. Gee. I'm not. Hey, I'm not. I'm just saying that, like, the thing that I fell in love with, all the series and stuff, it's gone. So, like, I can't delude myself and think I'm about to. It's the thought of spending five more years doing videos that makes me want to fucking kill What myself. the hell happened? Did the ball and you hit your head and had the freaking per what the concussion screw you? No. Own up to it. There's people. I don't want to have to do it, Dad. I don't want to have you to. You have to do it. Do you know it. how what hard it's gonna be to make that much money again just to pay you off and then try to make some money for myself? I'm, I can't do that many videos again. Don't think about how much you need to make. You think about how much you gotta make. Gotta make is is different. I don't want to. Why? Then that's a problem. Yeah. Like snap there, that looks like. in the face and snap out of it, Buttercup. Come on! You know, guys, uh, sorry to pause it, but you notice that. Hang on, let me go to that. Look right there. I don't know why. I, I, Nick kind of uh, aligned his head with those horns. That's basically. It looks like we're actually seeing the devil right now, but. It's a little unusual that Jesse's not inspired. If you guys remembered, he was so inspired in making videos from 2006 from 2016. It was great, and now he's uh, now right now we're seeing him uh, all said that it's not going to be the same. It shouldn't be the same. It's good to try new things. Then that's a problem. Yeah. 
Smack yourself in the face and snap out of it, Buttercup. Come on! <laughs> it's no longer about, you know, oh, I, I'm, I'm sitting at the top of the world. I'm a one-hit wonder. Everybody loves me. you got fans that kiss your ass, blow smoke up your ass. You've got cameras. You're not listening. It's not fun anymore. I don't care about fun. Look at my life. Look at your mother's life. Our whole life revolved around providing a household and providing you for everything and your brother with everything. Do you think we enjoyed every day? No. We woke up every day at 5 or 5.30 in the morning, and then we went to work. That's your Get, choice. No, it isn't. What are you going to do if you can't, when you wake up? You going to sit in the street? There's poor people in this world that can't make a living. you got an opportunity to make a living. you got fans that want you to make a living, and you sit here and feel sorry for yourself. You're sitting in my basement in a pile of shit because I can't get rid of it because your mother doesn't want to get rid of all your stuff without your permission. Do you understand what I'm saying? Alright. Don't feel sorry for yourself. I brought you up and learned you better than that. So did your mother. Now we've got a wedding to go to. Now think about this. I'm not I'm done. Go. I'm, I'm getting go. done preaching. I want to go. I don't care if you want to go. Well, either way, guys. He... So I gotta get started on video. But think about this: the life and the year we've had. Uncle Chris wanted to go to this wedding band. He planned on this. The whole pandemic last year. We're going to Wilbur's wedding. I get to see my sister. I haven't seen in two years. Who has cancer? That. Yeah, well, I haven't yeah. seen my older brother. I don't even know where he's at. So. You think, well, I, I didn't... Why would you even bring that up to me? You're talking about seeing your family. My old brother does, doesn't even want to talk to me. So you ever think you're the one that pushed him out? Yeah, yeah, you're going to give me a leer? No, you pushed him out. Uh, you put the freaks in the house next door to him. The man sad. couldn't sleep. Where is he? Where is he? Are you seriously going to ask me that? You don't know? He's not responding, no. I saw a video, I don't know where he's at or who he's with or what he's going on there. I'll text you his address, alright? you got to make a mess. I don't have the luxury that. I can't go talk to my wife. Right. I really can't. I'll go see him. I'll text you. You go see him, you talk to him. Iron right. shit out. Really? Okay. Please? Yeah. Family means everything right now. That's all we got. Alright? All right? Yeah. I hope so. Sit here and feel sorry for yourself. Add everybody, what you do, you blew it all, and then you have the. Uh, never mind. Okay. That's true. He had all this money and blew it off. Like I said, guys, control your money. I have side to that. I don't freaking shit. Hey, easy come, easy go. That's what they always say, Look, guys. I have no ideas for content. I really don't. So, if you do me a favor, Mm -hmm. Be like a reoccurring hemorrhoid on that boy and just follow him around <laughs> he goes. If he takes his shit, be in there. If he yeah. goes to the dentist, be there. So, yeah, like, oh, when was the last time you went to a dentist? But yeah, the, uh, the sun was out yesterday and I think everything was good. But, you know, then the rain came later on in the afternoon. Huh? I didn't want to hear everything. So. Just follow him? Huh? Just follow him? I know, I'm just waiting. Because he's probably in there eavesdropping on everything. Yeah. But either way, I want you to follow him around, whatever you need to do. Okay. Whatever it takes. You know, sneak in his room. I don't give a crap. Right. You know, follow him out. We need content. We need views. Yeah. He needs money, all right? Yeah. Especially us. Yeah, we want the. Yeah, yeah the, I'm sure the fans right. want to Seriously, see more of this guy. Okay. We're seeing him feeling sorry for himself, yeah, which I don't understand. Hmm. Too bad. Too bad. Too bad? Yeah. No, I can counter sue you for filming oh, me right now. Oh, you? Yeah. It's your dad's house. It's private property. What are you going to do? <laughs> wow. Here, it's your channel anyway. Nick, seriously, if you join what that are you movie, doing? That little asshole. Where are you going? It's none of your business. I want to see my brother. Oh. All I'm saying is the channel is going to help you pay off your debt. It's right. your dad and the okay. You got my way, please? No, I'm coming with you. What? Yeah, I'm coming over. No, you're not. Yes, I am. 
We're going. On what basis do you think you're gonna come with me? For content. Like I said, it's gonna help pay the debt off. It's your channel. What do you want? Not want to be in your own videos anymore? It's your channel. Sit yeah. down. All right, seriously. Just don't. Just stay out of my business. All right, film me, whatever. Get a long shot or something. I ain't way close to me. You know when you first joined, you said you never turn. You fucking turned. Yeah, well, you've been turned. That's right. Oh, wow. That is true. I mean, what the hell happened to this guy? Stay in the car. No, come over with me, bro. You're not. I don't even know if this is his house, okay? Oh, it is. What? It is his house. How do you know that? He had me doing construction for me. Paid me. Oh, shut the f up. No, he did. Oh, yeah. This is a personal matter with me and my bro. Well, I'm coming. Is this this is his house? Yes. What this house? Yeah. Yeah, he has a girlfriend too. Why are you just call him? No, f you. What? I might just go inside. You can't just do that. Jesse, you're staying high. Stay. Did you back off me? If you're gonna film me, give me my damn space. I don't know what your problem is. Yeah, Jess, what is your problem? Jeffrey! Jeffrey! He's gonna be surprised that it looks exactly, it almost looks as, exactly the same as the house. Down here. Well, here we go. Let's find out why he moved. Despite being with his girlfriend. What's going on? Uh. First time I see you in here. Came to see, I guess, is your new house? I'm not gonna buy that shit. What the f you doing here? Now you get your address, so I figured to stop by here. I'm turning my thoughts, so I figured, hey, I'm returning my thoughts. You got a lot of f nerve going here. What wow. shit, you fool? No. I, that's why we're here. I didn't know you had all this going on. You didn't yeah, respond no. to any of my calls. Oh, well, I guess that's reciprocation now, huh? Because you didn't respond to any of my texts. Yep, <laughs> you never texted me. Oh, no, I was not recently. I'm talking about that in here, all the way up the spring. You just kind of abandoned me in the Halloway house with all, yeah, all no, the no, no, no. Actually, if you remember, I moved. I moved and got a really nice lake house, so yes, that's yes, where yes, I was. Oh, yes, yes, yes. You had a very nice lake house. I know, I, I know you decided to throw that in there. Throw what in there? I oh, it's very it. nice. It's very nice. I it was. It's a nice lake house. It was. Well done, Jess. Well done. As always, it's always about you. No. Good for you. It looks like you're leveling up, too. So, like, I'm... That's why I came. I wanted to know why the f you're here. I don't know what you f need. What were you about? I want to know what's going on. We have a wedding. <laughs> you want to know what's going on? There's a wedding coming up. Yeah, let's, let's go back to the beginning. Then. And when we f like have this alleyway house, and all of a sudden you up and go because you all of a sudden decide, you know what? One house isn't enough for me. I want two. And you know what? How about this house? It's also worth three to four times more than the house. I, I earned it. I wanted to treat myself. I wanted to treat myself to something nice. Okay. Yeah, but then you leave everybody else in their wake. Like, I'm sorry, like, like the guys there are great. Like, no offense, Nick, but they're just terrible to live with. Like, okay, hey, so you can tell that. You can tell you that. Tell that I don't know. I'm Do something. I've been texting you about I was that. I was in like, quarantine. I, I was locked away, and I was doing my own thing. Your phone isn't locked away. I was away. Story fire. I have a big business, and I had to freaking run. Okay. <laughs> Big business is in the ground now, but okay, whatever. Let's, 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 let's not talk about that, I guess. But I was talking about the fact that you had like, like Swifts was in the house and you could f hear his annoying little head laugh within the walls. You got Tippy like playing Black Pink nonstop. A girl crashes a car and it obscures with your car, but not that you give a shit. And I didn't come here. I didn't come here just to get berated, bro. I seriously, I got better things to do. They come here and you're all this shit. What was me? When? And why did you come here? What do you, what do you need? I want to, you're going to be at the wedding, so I don't want things to be offered because you haven't been responding to me. So that's all. So you and show up and break into my house in your yeah, you brand new white sneakers? Oh yeah, I didn't notice that. But it's really, like, I don't understand the whole get up here, like, because, like, it almost, like, shows that you somewhat have, like, some sort of human conscience because you're wearing, like, eight dollar, like, Walmart stuff What the like, f*** are you doing? Why is it, why do you care so much about what I'm wearing, what I'm doing, where I'm living? Because it's it? just asshole. I don't know where that f***ing came from. At least the Walmart sweatpants look like the brother I used to have. That's all they had in a parent's house. It's my free clothes from ten years ago. Like, what happened? Like, all my hard work didn't lead to, this is where I'm at? I'm back to this now? Okay, so so, I don't like wearing it. That's okay. That just proves my point that you're changing. I wish I had a house or I've changed. No. Yeah. There you have. 
I want to do nice things for myself and have nice things in life. What are the Jesse and the Singer series that literally had like long hair and a beard and would like go out to a bar wearing that and sweatpants? Like, okay. Uh, uh, yeah. uh, wow. Like, this is your appearance. At one point, a million dollar like mansion. But like, I'm sorry that, 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 that you know you needed that to. I needed that. I love it. Bring it up. Yeah, what else? What else? Get it all off your chest. However you're feeling. Oh, uh, right. I. I have to like, I don't know what the this is. Like, why, why you, you show up to my house and you want to, like, make nice, like, hey, this is a nice house you got here, Jeffrey. Oh, oh, we're going to go to a wedding soon. Maybe I'll get this one up suing me. Good for you. Good, Good for you. you. That's what you say? Thank you. Thank you. And now he's filming me because of dad. Because dad, because that's how I got to pay my debts off. I can't vote for myself. I got dad over here on my ass again. Well, thanks. It's not like you're well. You cared. Not like you cared. Anyway, you know, if this, how would you feel if this was the last words you said to me? You know. Oh, what the f are you talking about? You are like some police shit right now. If this is what the last. Thing you said. If this is the last thing you said, really, how would you feel, Jeffrey? Your brother's channel is dead, and I'm over here struggling, and and back to square one, and and these are the things you said. Thanks. Thank you. Great. You hit the ground. You get yourself back up. Get back to who you are. I'll be this asshole we are now. Yeah. Yeah. Why are you acting this way? Why do you? Oh, hey. Oh, hey. Uh, what the hell are you doing? Jeez. Um. Yeah, I just was visiting my brother. Oh, okay. You live here? I do live here. Yeah. Oh, okay. Cool. Yeah, yeah. We're just on our way out. All right. Cool. Awesome. Yeah, I was hoping that's what you were gonna say. Wow. I was hoping that's what you were gonna say. When I come home from work and I like your brother was telling me everything and everything all the f shit that's going on in your life and I just uh, don't really have to want that when I come home from work. I just okay. can't yeah, put we're up with that just, kind of family. We're here to see you, we're just here. Yeah, okay, cool. Congrats on the house. Oh, yeah. Yes. Thanks. Yeah. yeah, no, it's nothing compared to like your grand old lake house and stuff like that, but no. Yeah, I'm so that's I'm not it's not mine. Yeah, okay. But cool. It yeah. was, you know, all nice and stuff like that. I'm sure it's just a little stuff compared to yours. Okay. Are you alright? you have a good day at work or whatever? Uh, yeah, no. I just, I really just can't stand people like you, Jess. I just... Like me like what? Like, like just flashing all your money and buying all your stuff, your new shoes and your this and your that and just thinking you're better than everyone else with your YouTube and your... Oh, okay. Yeah. Wow. You know, you never yeah, really introduced me, Jeffrey. Introduced you? Really? You could met months ago. We met. Okay, I forgot. I didn't. Get into your house. I forgot. Are you still here? Can I yeah, crash you here? You didn't tell me your brother you was here. Crash here? Yeah. No. no. I mean, you would crash here, but as long as like I can antagonize the shit out of you for the first, no. so you don't get any sleep at all. How about that? That way, like at least you get some. What if, what if I ended up somewhere? I don't know what that means. What if I end up somewhere? Where'd you go, then? Jess? Go to Disney. No. You know what I mean. I don't know. What are you talking about? Um, so, uh, so very clear. Okay, so I'm not worried. It'll be fine. What What is he talking about? Why does he feel like he lost everything? Wow, he really is acting like a psycho kid. I think I kind of get what's going on. He lost every. He lost his business. Is he hey. good? What is that? What? Yeah. Uh, uh, yeah. He just flew back. What? Yeah, Whoa! Back. What the hell no. is? No, I swear. What? What was that? It's gotta be killing me. Wow. I gotta say, guys, that, that, that is crazy. That is very crazy. You know, I think I kind of get what's, I kind of get what's going on. I mean, I think, we, you know, guys, that, the thing is, I think I kind of get what's going on here. And I think, I, I think the answer is pretty obvious. Pretty, pretty obvious. You know, guys, mm, 
You know, I think, you know, this whole year, I think it's this year that, yeah, we lost Uncle Chris. Yeah, we lost Uncle Chris and Grandmom this year. February. February, I think it was in January, I believe. I think it was like almost the beginning of the new year. We find out that they're gone. It's kind of upsetting, guys, knowing the fact that, you know, we lost a lot of loved ones all through the years. I think basically, guys, I think we're basically seeing, like, someone who's lost. And I got to say, guys, I think that's the, I think this is the whole point of this thing. I, I just didn't understand the fact that why he acted the way he did. He's saying that what if I'm some what if I what if I'm somewhere? What if I'm somewhere that you don't know where I am? Oh. You know, why does he think that just because he lost everything, he why does he yeah, why does he feel like since he lost everything, he's got nothing? Uh, you know guys, like I said before, Manage your money, and also, guys, um, always, always make sure that you have people in your life to share it with. But, guys, he moved away from the family and went to Pennsylvania just because the taxes were low. I understand that. I understand that completely. He didn't want to go. He said he, he said he didn't want to go to uh, his cousin's wedding because he said it's not the same. Guys, I think I kind of get what he's talking about. I, th I think, I think we got the got the point of why Jesse's acting the way he is. You know, for him to charge rent, make him charge rent. He he just lost Story Fire, and he lost uh, his uncle and his grandmom in the same year. It kind of makes me wonder, like, um, makes me wonder, like, what his what. He's going through, guys. You know when you lo when you lose a family member, it's it's really bad. But when you lose two in the same year, I think that makes it a lot worse. Know this, guys. When I lost my when I lost my godmother, my aunt, I lost her in two thousand six, and that really broke me because this this is a, an aunt that I've seen almost all my life. She's been into every functions, every every school play, every birthday you name it every birthday she's there and she's the one that always uh smacks my face into the cake <laughs> and that always made me laugh so much <sighs> you know i'm not, i'm starting to get emotional but you know what I, I miss that so much you know guys with family when you see somebody every day, it makes it great. But then when you wake up one morning and you find out that that person's gone, you don't see them anymore as much as you do. It, that That's when you wake up and realize that, wow, life is, look, life, life is short. Like they always say life is short, but always make sure that you do a lot of things in your life that are worthwhile. It, with family... With family guys, you can do a lot of things with fa with friends, but you're only getting you can make the one thing about friends is you can make a lot of friends, but you're only getting one mom, one dad, one aunt, one uncle, one's brother, sister, cousins, all that stuff, guys, grandparents, you name it. You could, but you never know how long it's going to be, so you have to make every single second count, because guys, before you know it. It's just, it, you'll just wake up one morning and then realize that I shouldn't be, I shouldn't be acting this way. I, I, you know, it's funny. I, my, you know, my, with my aunt, she wouldn't want me to feel sorry for myself that I shouldn't say all the things that I should have said to her. But you know, <sighs> but she knew. Yeah, she knew. She knew. <sighs> the last time I would have seen her was on Father's Day, but I got so tired from work. I just stayed home, and I did. The next two days, I find out she's gone. It made that that made me sad the most. 
And this was last week. Last week was when I lost my godmother. This was 15 years ago. 15 years. And then the next year I lost my grandpa in the same month. That's why I don't like June very much. Because I lost those th those those two people in my life. <laughs> you know what my grandpa said when she's when he saw her on her on her, on the bed? She he was so upset he's like I wish I could take her place. It should be me right here, not her. <laughs> I just walked up to her. I said, hi, it's me, Junior. That's what she used to call me all the time. And I said, get better, please. I, I, I don't want you to go. I love you. And it's just sad. But enough about me. I'm sorry. <laughs> Got off topic. But overall, guys, I think we're seeing what we're seeing for Jesse is, I mean, five guys, five year marks the anniversary of Psycho Series, and now he's feeling sorry for himself because he's not making the same content that like it used to be with the Psycho Series. I mean, think about this, guys. His mom made a pretty good point. Psycho Series lasted up to two to three years, and then the next year they did they did the that year they, the same year they did. The Haunted Series and the Christmas Series. Next was The Devil Inside. And next it was um, My Virtual Escape. It kind of it kind of makes me wonder, like, how the hell have things changed so much? But that... Th guys, things change, and it's not going to remain the same all the time. you gotta, you got to try to do something interesting, make something new. That's the point. I mean, why would you try to try to do the same thing, but... Later, later down the road, you realize that maybe I should have done something differently. I think that's the point. I think that's the point of what we're seeing with Jesse is because he misses the old days, but you can't just go back to the past. It's like the saying, the past is history, tomorrow's a mystery, but today is a gift. That's why it's called the present. Always remember that, guys. Well, guys, don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more reaction gameplay. Drop some likes if you enjoyed this. All I know, guys, is that he got the answers. He he wondered why he found out why Jeffrey didn't text him because he just upped and left, didn't say a word, and he just act like oh I got this one point something million dollar mansion, this house, lake house, I should treat myself. But he didn't. I I, I just I think the I think everybody's upset with the fact that he didn't think about them. Or coming with this decision. I don't know, guys. This It's just me. But I think what we're seeing is we're just seeing that Jesse just has no money. He has no way of showing everybody that. I mean, if you guys noticed, he said, why do you keep looking at my shoes? What's the deal? And I said, what the deal is, is that you have all this money. You were flashing all this around us. And now it's gone. And, and now he lost the business. And now I say, what if I'm somewhere else? What if I'm not going to be here? I'm like... I have a feeling, guys, something's up. I think he's going to leave this world. I think he's going to. I think he's going to be a new person. I think Isaac will come back. I don't know, but we'll see. All right, guys, thank you guys for watching, and don't forget, stay positive, and thanks for listening.